Hey guys, it's Monday morning and uh, I'm here sizing up the new layout. Ever since I pulled this layout out of storage, uh, I've been thinking what I've wanted to do to, uh, to get this section to its completion point. Um, I, uh, when I built it, I did a few things that uh, I, I just had a few ideas that weren't really going to quite fit. So uh, I just wanted to get you do another video and uh, maybe get some input from you guys into what you think works best. Uh, uh, as I said in the last video, this is a Sierra West Craftsman kit. Uh, and this is a, a commercial over-the-shelf kit that you find at a hobby shop. And this is a fine-scale miniatures kit. It's basically a scratch build in a box. Uh, this, this kit basically comes with wooden detail parts and lots of great instructions. Uh, this is a Builders in Scale lighthouse that I still have to find the cap for. You cleaned off the rail, get the railing C8 black back into that. Uh, you see the rail has fallen off. Right, it's, it's just hanging on for dear life. Uh, that rail fell off because of a Canadian winter. Uh, if you didn't know already, Crazy Glue or Cyanocrylate la, 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 CA uh, will, will uh, its, its greatest uh, enemy is freeze in cold, freezing cold. If you throw, if you crazy glued something and you can't get it apart without wrecking it, uh, one way to get that thing apart is by throwing it into the freezer. That's proof. So, let me zoom in here. Okay, so, as you can see, this area right here is pretty darn empty. Now, what I was going to do uh, originally was to build a big billboard sign that would be facing that way. Because, you know, the public would be coming down to the beach. This, this is a nice uh, public thoroughfare. This is a more uh, business area on this side. Um, so this, this would have shown advertisements maybe for this or maybe Coca-Cola or something of the sort. However, I decided that uh, this could be a little spot for another part, uh, another opportunity to do some uh, super detailing. Uh, what I'm thinking is maybe put another dock out here and uh, kind of like this and then in the background have uh, the day-to-day -day busy working life of a, of a laborer or a dock worker uh, maybe a ship under construction maybe maybe just storage or, or materials uh, maybe a little shanty for some uh, people who don't have a house and they work on the docks and you know they basically live down here so uh, tell me what you think uh, should this uh, area should I just put a billboard there and be done with it should I add another scene here um, you know I recognize that sometimes a scene needs a break in between the two so that they look good uh, but on the other hand you know the uh, on the seaside or, or the the um, 
at the water, uh, space is at a premium. So everybody's got to get out on the water. So maybe this is the perfect spot for another, for another boardwalk or, or dock area. Um, this is hard shell here, so it'll be hard to, to manipulate it, but I can get in there. Um, just to explain some of the things that I've done here, uh, you see these rocks back here, they're carved out of, uh, the blue foam that's made, you can see the blue foam down here. Uh, this is carved out of blue foam. I use uh, uh, I used a technique that I learned from Trolls Kirk, a, gentle, a master craftsman gentleman from Sweden. Um, he uses a uh, cyan the CA glue to uh, melt the 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 foam after you've cut it and it makes the bricks more pronounced um, I've colored this but I haven't done the final color on this I think I'm also gonna bring this fence all the way to the end here and then maybe put a a fence here maybe maybe my uh, billboard can be put here facing the store or facing the the, the boardwalk here um, who knows uh, I'm looking for you guys input um, on this so uh, lots of questions to be answered this kit is not near done or this diorama is not near done there's a whole slew there's a whole bunch of real estate in the back near the tracks that has to be filled up I just think that this this part of the beach is the last uh, part of the thing the puzzle I'm gonna add a picture of uh, of what I think I should put here at the end of this video uh, probably right now um, this kit, this this building is uh, part of a craftsman kit called uh, Tidewater Wharf. It is uh, one of three buildings that come with the kit. I'm just going to slip this one in here. I, I was thinking of slipping this one in here and uh, using the other two uh, on on another spot of this uh, marine inspired series because I'm going to build. I think I'm going to build one more module this size, which is two feet by four feet. Uh, one more to uh, get this all, this scene completed and uh, out of my mind. Well guys, thanks for uh, watching. And if you, uh, if you like this video, please share it on social media or maybe share it with your friends somewhere. Um, just share it because I don't have many viewers yet. Have a great day, guys.